Uh, Shalom, first and foremost, I'd like to give all praises and glory and honor to to Yahweh Bashem, Yahweh Shah, Bashem, Kakadash, Shalom to the uh, elders, Wa Akim, Wa Akwa, and I say Shalom. And this is a uh, sit down lesson that I want to bring out of the Prophet Jeremiah, chapter 51, and verse 7 through verse 9. And this is the book of Prophet Jeremiah, chapter 51, and verse 7, and it reads Babylon has been a golden cup in the, in the Lord Yahweh's hand, then they all the herb drunken. The nations have drunk enough for wine, therefore the nations are mad. Right, just like that took place in ancient Babylon. You had the Tower of Babel during those times. You know, ancient Babylon. Now you're seeing this taking place in the modern day version of Babylon. Because this modern day version of Babylon have all the nations drunk enough for wine. Therefore the nations are angry and mad at this modern day version of Babylon. Especially this uh, system of what it promotes. Even this wickedness and unrighteous decrees, and still to this day. Jeremiah 51 and verse 7 Babylon has been a golden cup in the Lord's hand, which still to this day, like it did in ancient times, that made all the earth drunken. The nations have drunken up for wine, therefore the nations are mad. Jeremiah 51 and verse 8 Babylon is suffering falling and destroyed. How for her take by for her pain, so she may be healed. Just like ancient Babylon thought it was going to heal, now we see this modern day version of the Babylon is not going to uh, be healed. Jeremiah 51 and verse 9, we would have healed Babylon, but she is not healed. Forsaking her, let us go everyone to his own country, for her judgments reach up to the heavens, and it's lifted up even to the sky. So the uh, judgments of Babylon have been reached up to the heavens, and it's lifted up even to the sky. It's just like in ancient times, now it's taking place in modern day times. So the modern day, the modern day version of our Babylon, of this system, is being exposed of what it is, of evilness and wickedness, of what it promotes, and the nations are angry at, at mad at her of this modern day version of our Babylon. So that the Father is going to keep exposing this modern day Babylonian system just like He did in ancient times, because this uh, crypt, the scriptures clearly says Ecclesiastes one and verse nine, there is no new thing under the sun. So this was just a quick sit down lesson of the prophet Jeremiah 51 and verse 7 through verse 9 that I want to bring out. So with that, I'd like to give all praises and glory and honor to to Yahweh Bashem, Yahweh Shai Bashem, or Kakadash. Shalom to the uh, elders, Ma'akim, Ma'akwa. Till next time, I will say Shalom.